What is going on guys, this is the Kev 2013 and today we're going to talk about the new iPhone 5S, the iPhone 5C, and iOS 7. Now as September is rolling in pretty soon, uh, today is August 26th, so September is almost here, a lot more rumors have been pouring in for the new iPhone 5S and 5C and iOS 7. We already know uh, iOS 7, but we have a... Um, a date that it's probably going to come out from um, some reliable sources not confirmed but from reliable sources it's going to come out in this day and we'll talk about that in a second first I want to talk about the iPhone 5s um, they had some new things that are going to be, probably be in the iPhone 5s that they've uh, been talking about and from some reliable sources uh, and I'll leave the links down below uh, some new things new specs the camera it's probably going to be a little bit better of a camera than the iPhone 5. Um, the latest speculation of the camera claims it will have a larger 2.0 aperture um, that could match up to the HTC One, dual LED flash, and uh, it could be a little bit bigger than the iPhone 5s. Um, this means more light will get through, improving image quality and low light performance. There's been a lot of talk about fingerprint scanner reader in the home button. So to unlock your phone, you would just put your finger to your home button and it would unlock your phone if your finger um, matches up to what you have it programmed to. Technology would be coming from Authentitech, um, a fingerprint scanner technology that's been working with Apple since last year. So that's been a lot of talk. Um, new chips, uh, a 128 gigabyte flash storage option is the precious speculation that they have going on right now. Also, Apple's A7 processor is also expected. Uh, another thing would be new 3G slash 4G standard support. Um, so it'd have LTE and all that. And those are a few of the specs. And then there's been talking about an alleged gold iPhone 5S. And they've had pictures leaked. Um, so they have the black sleek material on the iPhone 5 and then the white with the little silver coloring and now they're saying it's going to be a gold backing of the iPhone 5 with the white at the bottom. A lot of people are saying that the gold is more champagne colored but they're calling it gold. It's apparently assembled in China. Uh, they've had some people leak some pictures it's kind of crazy that they would do gold people are scratching their heads like why would you do that um but yeah i i personally it looks okay to me i personally like the black and the sleek material that are the sleek coloring and stuff that's on the black one um on the iphone 5 i have the iphone 4s and mine's the white version so yeah, iPhone 5S is gold. Give me your thoughts down in the comments down below what you think about that. Now also they have the iPhone 5C that is also rumored. And um, the iPhone 5C, the C is standing for color. And it's going to be a cheaper version of the iPhone 5 and it's going to have different colors. The iPhone 5C would be a low cost model made substantially from plastic and not from the material that this is made out of. It's going to be a cross between the iPhone 5 and the 5th generation iPod Touch. Um, it's going to have a 4 inch screen. And the back is going to be similar to the iPhone or the 5th generation iPod Touch. Sorry, And it's going to be shaped similar to an iPod Classic. So it's going to be a little bit different, a little bit cheaper. And they're going to have different colors. Um, like uh, red and blue and green, all the different colors. So that'll be pretty cool that you can have different options and for people that want an iPhone but can't afford the bills and stuff that are um, associated with it. So that's a good way of getting Apple to let customers buy an iPhone without having to pay how much it is. Um, now let's talk about iOS 7. An update on when to expect it. Uh, they're thinking Tuesday, September 10th will be when Apple will unveil the next generation iPhones and then it's going to be the first public release of iOS 7. Uh, 
Now, the big, the biggest question they have is whether Apple will release iOS 7 for the iPad and iPad Mini on the same day. Apparently, these sources are guessing that they won't. Apple's next iOS version will launch with the iPhone and iPod Touch between September 11th and September 18th, and the iPad version will be delayed until October 11th, or October, sometime in October. Um, not exactly sure why. They're announcing the two new iPhones, the 5S, the 5C, um, maybe the gold version. Be some new iPads, probably another iPad Mini, um, an iPad fifth, uh, iPad fifth generation will probably be announced. Um, the new, there's probably gonna be some new Macs launched, and OS Mavericks, OS X Mavericks for the Macs will probably be um, released as well. Uh, the new iPods, uh, they haven't really been talking about them. Um, but I'm sure they will talk about them or wait till the next event, which will be not in September, but the next one, which is in October. Uh, they might be then. They have a calendar for this thing, for these uh, announcements, and it says Tuesday, uh, September 10th, iPhone 5S launch on uh, Friday, no, September 13th. Um, the iPhone 5S will start having pre-orders. And probably the iPhone 5 uh, 5C and the Gold and all those, they'll probably be able to pre-order then on the September 13th. On September 18th, they're saying iOS 7 will be released. And on September 20th, which is my birthday, I'll be turning 19, will be the iPhone 5S uh, release date. So those are predictions. Um, they've been coming from some reliable sources. And I'll leave those sources down in the comments below or not in the comments, but the description. So if you want to check those out, you can do that. Um, all the pictures that you've seen that may have popped up, uh, the links will be in the description as well. Um, let me know what you guys are excited for. Are you excited for the new iPhone 5S, the 5C? Are you happy to see a gold version of the iPhone? Are you excited for iOS 7? I like to see those comments down in the uh, down in the comment section below. I'm really excited for the iPhone, uh, not the iPhone, but the uh, iOS 7. I'm ready to play around with it, see some different changes. I still got my contract on this uh, iPhone, so I won't be able to get the iPhone 5S when it first comes out. But I will definitely, when I um, get my upgrade in a couple of months, I'll be getting the iPhone 5S. Um, so yeah, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Uh, leave this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Um, I will also make a video the day they release all this stuff each day they release something um i will have videos and i will tell you what they announced and show pictures and stuff so yeah thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace